Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Once you have customized a presentation by adding the slide masters and slide layouts you want, you can save it as a template that can be used to create new presentations in the future. To save a presentation as a custom template, click the File tab in the ribbon and then click the Save As command. For PowerPoint 2013, you can select to save the file to your computer and then click the Browse button to the right. For PowerPoint 2016, choose the This PC command and then choose a folder to the right or click the Browse button. In both versions of PowerPoint, you will then see the Save As dialog box appear. In the Save As dialog box, type a name for your new template into the file name text box. Then select either PowerPoint Template or PowerPoint Macro Enabled Template from the Save As Type dropdown. You should save it into the default folder that PowerPoint then selects for you so that you may be able to access it easily in the future. This folder that PowerPoint selects is where PowerPoint stores its default templates. That way, in the future, you can easily select the template to use as a basis for new presentations by simply choosing it from the listing of available templates that is shown when you create a new presentation. When you are ready, click the Save button to save the template. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.